Question 10. Here is a number chart. It says circle the smallest number on the chart that it is a multiple of both 2 and 7. Well, we're only interested in multiples of 2 and 7. Now, multiples of 2 are even numbers. So, anything that's odd, we can cross out straight away. So, that's odd, 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 odd. 81 and 91 are odd. 83 and 93 are odd. 85, 95, 87, 97. I've crossed out all the odd numbers, so only the even numbers are left. But it's also got to be a multiple of 7. So I need to be interested in my multiples of 7. Now, I do know that there's no point writing out all of my 7 times table because I've only got to go as low as 72. So 10 sevens would be 70. Now, I'll just keep adding on 7. So 77, 84... 91, 98, 105, 112. Obviously, we don't need to go any further because we've gone past 100. So these are the numbers which are my 7 times table. That one's odd, so I'm not interested in that one. That one's odd, so I'm not interested in that one. These two are both over 100, so I'm not interested in those. So I've only got 70, 98, and 84. 70 is not in the list. Is 84? Yes, it is. Is 98? Yes, it is. But it does so. They are the only two possible answers that are multiples of 2 and 7. However, it does say circle the smallest. So the only number I should have circled should have been 84 because that's the smallest one. If we get a different colour for the next question, it says here is the same number chart. Circle the largest number that is not a multiple of 2, 3 or 5. So we can't have multiples of 2. So let's cross out the multiples of 2, all even numbers. So anything that's even is a multiple of 2 and we can't have it because it says not multiples of 2. That's all the multiples of 2 crossed out. I can't have multiples of 5. Now, I know that multiples of 5 end in 0. Well, all of they have gone. 18, 19, 100 have all gone. But they also end in 5. So, anything that ends in a 5 can go. Now, I can't have multiples of 3 either. So, what do we know about multiples of 3? Well, we could say, start with 90, because 90 is 30 times by 3. And then we could just start taking off 3s from that, from 90. So, and they would be multiples of 3. So, take off 3 from that would be 87. That's got to go. Take off another 3 is 84. That's already gone. Take off another 3 is 81, that's gone. Take off another 3 is 78, it's already gone. 75 is already gone. 72 is already gone. If we go the other way, we can add on 3 is to 90. Add on 3 is 93. Add on another 3 is 96. And on another 3 is 99. So we've eliminated all the multiples of 2, all the multiples of 3, and all the multiples of 5. So circle the largest number, there's not any of those. So we've only got to choose from the ones that are left, and we're interested in the largest one. So the largest one is going to be this 97 here, so it's the 97 we need to circle.